Okay guys, so here today is another Ford Mustang rant. Uh, this time is about the sync system. The uh, last time um, I posted a video about how unreliable the AC is, which uh, broke twice in about a year. Um, and this time, like um, this afternoon, my wife is driving home and suddenly she says uh, the Bluetooth stopped working. So, um, and I was taking a look and it looks like, it looks like the Bluetooth module uh, is failed because um, I'll show you in a little bit. And by the way, this uh, SYNC system is totally junk. Um, if you can get the SYNC 3, you should get the SYNC 3. So if I go into manual and I go to SYNC settings and check on the Bluetooth. So here's the problem. If you try to turn the Bluetooth off and reset it, it doesn't. Basically, it's locked into the initiation mode. So whatever you do, it keeps saying initializing BT, please try again. And there's no way you can get around it. Um, I already deleted the uh, old device in here. I was hoping to reset it uh, that way, but obviously that's not the problem. The problem is the Bluetooth module has failed. Um, so what I'm going to try now is actually go under the hood and uh, disconnect the battery while at the same time doing a master reset and hopefully see if the problem gets fixed. So when it does master reset, I think I have to turn the car off and uh, turn it back on so it would, re it would reset the uh, sync system. Um, this, this system has given my wife a lot of problems. Uh, she's not happy about the system or the setup. But I think um, in general, Bluetooth is, is a unreliable or I would say still a unmature technology in cars because uh, for my 2014 Honda Accord, the Bluetooth system also have a lot of quirks and it would freeze up and it would stop playing music and hand up on calls and all that kind of crazy stuff. So um, in general, the Bluetooth still needs uh, refinement in the automobile industry, in my opinion. So uh, it looks like it's it's reset uh, the entire six system. So let's go into manual and see if the Bluetooth gets fixed or not. Hopefully it doesn't say initializing. Oops, crap. So it's broken. Um, so I'm gonna go to under the hood and uh, disconnect the battery and see if it would fix the problem. Um, I'll update you guys in a little bit. Okay, so I just disconnected the battery terminal, uh, negative battery terminal, to do a radio reset. And let's see if that fixes the problem. By the way, to access this uh, battery compartment, you'll have to remove a top cover. Um, there are two pins you need to remove. One is over here, and one is over here. Um, it's very easy to lift. You just basically twist the pin, lift the top part, and lift the bottom part, so it comes out. Okay. So in a little bit, um, we're gonna go inside and test to see if the problem is fixed. All right. So moment of truth. Uh, let's do a test. Go back to the sync menu and see if the Bluetooth uh, module is fixed or not. I would say reset. So right now it still says Bluetooth is on. Try to turn it off or adjust the settings. Now the problem is fixed. So um, as I suspected, if you do a master reset, it doesn't fix the problem. You have to completely disconnect the battery terminal and uh, for about 30 seconds and reconnect. Um, that way, if there's some sort of like uh, circuitry short, um, it would reset itself. And uh, let's see. Um, but uh, that's it. So I'm gonna add her phone back into the system um, and uh, stop ranting about it. And maybe next time if the problem happens, I'll just do a reset. All right. Thanks guys for watching. And uh, if you have any questions or comments, uh, feel free to write uh, in the comment section below and I'll try my best to answer. Thanks again.